you guys know, last episode, we completed headhunting on my Skyblock server, psychosky.com. And with completing that, we get access to open up the wealth chest, which makes it so we can actually gain IS top value. And we're currently worth about $50 million right now. We are currently the 13th richest island, but by completing headhunting, you get to unlock a few features that I have been really hyped for. There's one, actually, that I've been really, really hyped for. And I've wanted since day one. And that is my own personal fishing lake, or your own island lake, should I say. And today, we have completed it. Now, I haven't went there yet because I wanted to save my reaction and go there first on camera. We also managed to complete the blaze spawners and the pig zombie spawners, which was great. We haven't bought any of these yet because we didn't know how much money we might need because I'm going to show you in a second. There's still more to do with the lake and we kind of wanted to save our money and just wait a second. We still need to get the silverfish spawners done. That one is very, very important. But it will be done. So once you complete your lake mission, what you do is slash lake. That should take you there. It'll take you uh, five seconds to teleport. And boom. You are at your own personal war zone fishing lake, basically. You cannot be killed here. You are all good. But there is a catch. So to put it simple, this lake has a stock, a certain amount of stock. And currently right now, our lake is default. So as you can see, fish caught zero out of 64. So we can only catch 64 fish from this lake every reboot. But the thing is though, you might be like, that's pretty bad. No, this is only the beginning because this guy over here, the fishing chief, which is such a cringy name, but whatever, <laughs> has some very interesting stuff. So here you can upgrade your stock so you can catch more fish every reboot. You can um, upgrade your catch rate and you can upgrade your lock. So the more stock you have, the more you can fish between reboots, which is great because obviously being here, you know you're not going to die. You can fish in peace and it's awesome. Now, we can upgrade right now. Well, we can. We can only upgrade once. But see, lock here. This is the reason why I wanted to save it. Now, what you usually need is an upgrade crystal, which you can see requires 1x upgrade crystal. And what you get, you get these from the Warzone Fishing Lake. And I currently have one, so we're definitely going to upgrade today. But with lock here, you can see that it's not actually, it doesn't require, oh, and catch rate. These two things right here don't require, or the first levels at least, don't require anything to do with island balance. So we're just going to upgrade as much as we can. Ah, there we go. So that requires one. So to upgrade to the next one, we need another upgrade crystal, which I don't know if to upgrade stock or lock. I would probably say stock and then go lock. Um, catch rate is n nothing required there, so I'm going to upgrade this. And, uh, okay, next one, we need another upgrade crystal. So, I have currently right now one upgrade crystal, and these things are hard to get. And they're not the easiest. So what do I upgrade? Do I upgrade luck more, or do I upgrade stock? So if I upgrade right now with this one, this will give me 128 items that I can fish out. And if I upgrade this again, this makes rare items become slightly more common. New items available, advanced treasures, bottle of souls. This is a hard one, I don't know. <laughs> okay, what do you do when you can't decide? You spin a wheel, because that's the best way to do things. <laughs> okay, here we go. Three, two, one. Lock or stock. Let's do this. What's it gonna be? I don't care what it is. It's gonna be stock. Okay, I'm actually kind of happy with it because I was actually swaying a little bit more to stock, to be honest. All right, so stock it is. Okay, next time I'm, I meet like a crossroads like that where I can't decide, I'm just gonna do that every single time because that's the way to go. Now, next one is 192. Need another upgrade crystal, obviously. And hopefully we'll get this upgraded soon. I wonder, will this help me out? Now, I do have a guardian mask which doesn't um, increase the luck a little bit of my fi like of fishing. Now, sadly, it isn't fully leveled out, but hopefully that'll help me a bit. Now, I'm gonna IS the it all my money and we're gonna see how much money we make from 128 fish now every single time you fish from this it is going to be a different experience every time because it's load of fish different amount of luck you just don't know what you're gonna fish out so i can't say we're gonna make a ton of money today but i'm not gonna lie the fact that we can't be killed right now is pretty darn nice right let's get this done let's catch this 128 fish Okay, so that's all done. I wouldn't say we've made a ton of money from this. Obviously, I think we need to really um, fully upgrade the lake, fully upgrade the lock. And also, I didn't realize, but the catch rate is definitely a thing that needs to be upgraded as well. And then I say we can give this thing an actual good try. Now, we did get a few um, enchanted fish, but not as many as I thought I would get. So I would be definitely interested, like I said, to see how it changes when we have this fully upgraded 
which may take a bit of time, but I'd be interested to see. Now, I was while I was fishing, I had an interesting thing in what I can do because I do want to get an IS top. Obviously, I want to be as rich as I possibly can. I don't think we're going to be the richest faction um, or richest island at 1.4 billion. No way, Jose, we ain't going there. But I do want to see if I can get into the top 10 mark, which shouldn't be hard. I'm the third. I'm we're already 13. But before I tell you that, we're going to sell a fish, see how much that made. I'm going to say, I would probably say 100k. Just over 100k. That's what I'm going to bet. Could be more, I don't know. Okay, it didn't even make us 100k. But like I said, it's all down to luck and what fish you get. But I will report back to you when I have a fully upgraded and then we'll see how much it makes us. But since we've unlocked um, zombie pigmen and blaze spawners, we now don't really have any need for zombies and skeletons and any other money spawns that we have because like the, those zombies and blazes are far superior than these ones so i am going to basically mine all these down i don't know how much they're worth and we're gonna dump it into the wealth chest and see how much money we make i think we have a decent few like we have a yeah like this is 40 already and is this number 40 or number 20 there we go this is number 20. So we have a stack and a bit of skeleton spawners. And then across the way, we also have zombie spawners which is over here. So this is surely going to be worth a lot of money. So like we could actually easily be one of the top 10 islands. Let's mine this. There's eight of these. I don't think we have as many of these as we do skeletons. Because obviously these only give you souls. So yeah, we definitely don't. Okay, right. So slash shop. Let's dump all this in. Let's see how much this is all worth. I'm interested to see. And then you got to remember, we still have 80 million. So then we can buy some spawners with that. And then whatever left over, I guess we can dump more into the wealth chest and see. Anyway, let's dump this in. So I just want to see how much the skeleton spawners are worth alone. So three, two, one, dump that in. That is sixteen million dollars. Holy smokes, that's a lot to store up. And then these should be. These are obviously going to be a little bit less. Three million dollars. So that brings us up to sixty-eight million. Which, if I do is top, have we made it onto that list yet? No, we haven't. We are worth sixty-eight million. Uh, Eleven rich factions worth seventy million. Okay, we can do this. No problemo. No problemo. But first, I'm going to buy some of these spawners before I waste all the money that we have. So these are a million each and these are 1.5 million. So I'm going to take out, mm, I would say, I'm going to take out 50 million and buy spawners. Is it worth it? Ah, we can always put them back in. Okay, so we can only have 24 million dollars in our balance and uh, blaze spawners. Okay, so we want to buy, okay, pig zombies are definitely the priority, 100%. So let's at least get 10 of these, that's a lot. <laughs> and then let's buy 9 of these. There we go, okay, I don't know if we'll, will that be enough for a second? Like, we can always buy more. Alright, I'm gonna buy as many um, pig zombies as I can. That should be enough blazes, because they're only for souls. This makes money, that's, a, that's the main thing. And let's PV these before I literally put them in the... <laughs> literally put them in this chest not thinking. Right, we are going to leave a bit of money. But we're going to buy as many spawners as we can. Doesn't matter what spawner we can. We're just literally converting our money into basically spawners. So it doesn't really matter what we do. It's all the same. So buy as many spawners as we can. So now, with pumping that all in, we are now IS top. Are we on IS top? We are. We are the ninth richest faction. Oh, come on. Okay. Okay, come on. Let's see if we can beat um, Arthad's fangirls island. Let's see if we can beat them. They're worth 111. So I'm literally just withdrawing all the money because it doesn't matter anymore. Like we've leveled up. We might as well be putting all our money into head hunting. We don't really need money for much more now. So let's just buy as many. Let's buy another 20 of these. I want to get to the eight richest faction. That's what I want to do. And I have a load of AFK spawner loot to sell as well, actually. Okay, let's dump these in. That brings us that's another 20 million, which brings us up to... The eighth richest faction, we beat them by two mil. <laughs> okay, I don't think, because obviously we just spent all our money. The next faction that we have to be is atypical. Um, and he's worth 151 million. His island is, I'm worth 113. I definitely don't have that money. I do have a little bit of AFK spawner loot down here to sell, but I don't think it's uh, like 50 mil worth. Uh, I guess it could be. Wait, do I have anything like. Do I have any keys? Do I have anything that I need to open that I haven't opened, you know, to help me out a little bit? I don't really think so, to be honest. No, I've kind of... Okay, there. Okay, gotta be careful. No. These are for here. Actually, let's put them down before we actually sell them by mistake and be like, Oh, we have spawners! And then not think. So, pig zombie, you can go here. Okay, so they're all placed down. Now, the reason why these are good. Now, let me show you why. These bad boys, which they can be one-shot, which is freaking nice, sell for... 
one single head sells for $175. Easy money, my friends. Now, we have a little bit of AFK loot. We're going to sell this, but I don't think it's going to make us 50 million. Like, I don't have that many chests filled, filled of this. Okay, so the Wither Essence got us up to 4 million. Now, I do have gas tiers down below, but our gas essences, but I don't think I have many of them. Now, these things, like, I love gas, but I need to get more of them. I keep getting Wither, uh, wither Skeleton Spawners. That's all I seem to get. These things sell for an amazing price, and obviously, you know my luck. I still haven't got a single IG yet, which I'm... Hoping to get soon, but like yeah, that's all the gas tiers I got which is such a shame would have been nice to have more So obviously that only made us four point like got us up to four million So I'm just gonna literally put that into the island for a second I'm not gonna like go buy spawners yet. It's not worth it But talking about not having an iron golem spawner right now I think psycho sky may have answered our prayers and if you can guess what we're gonna be doing next episode in skyblocks Comment down below you probably already know if you play the server. It's gonna involve a nice pickaxe, and it's gonna involve the war zone. Can you guess what it is? I'll see you in the next episode.